The Omaha City Council votes to scrap several gun laws in order to comply with the new state law. Many city leaders say it's not something they want to do, but have no choice right now. KATV News Watch 7's Quinesia Fraser is live with their concerns. Quinesia. Rob, the city attorney says he teaches police officers about gun ordinances, and now hundreds of them will have to relearn how to interact with people when a gun is involved. It's a change on the state level that limits what the city of Omaha can do when it comes to guns. LB 77 strips away the city's ability to have any regulation over the ownership, possession, storage, transportation, sale and transfer of firearms or other weapons. LB 77 is Nebraska's new law that allows concealed carry without a permit. And that means there are 22 Omaha City codes that are no longer enforceable. Whether you like it or not, yeah, we've got to get rid of the laws that the state legislature said we have to get rid of. City Attorney Matt Cousy says the ordinances being removed relate to a variety of situations, including the sale of firearms to minors and the possession of machine guns. Right now, if police pull someone over, Cousy says they have probable cause to search a vehicle for other possible crimes if they see a gun. But by September second, that changes. Now the police don't automatically have that probable cause if that gun is there. They might have to just let that person go and I'm sure what will be going through the officer's mind is also, I'm letting this person go who has a gun there. I certainly hope that they're not going to go and commit some sort of violent crime with it. I'm not saying that that's typical of what would happen. But that is going to be the new reality. A new reality that Omaha leaders, including the city council president and police chief, openly opposed before it was passed. So the local control is gone. The, the legislature decided that for us. Correct. The city of Omaha will no longer have local control over these matters. The city council is already looking at what it can do to take back some control. Council President Pete Festerson says they are able to regulate untraceable ghost guns, public spaces, and possibly bump stocks and accessories. Reporting live, Quinesia Fraser, KETV News Watch 7.